like white teeth Don't get me dirty Hi guys, I know that I said that I wanted to talk to you guys and let you know um, the space that I've been in, why my last vlog, or maybe I put this in that vlog if I can't finish the video, um, why it was so short, why I did not have, why I have not been vlogging. Um, there's been a lot of stuff going on. There's been a lot of stuff going on for a while. Um, we've just been dealing with it, praying, you know, pushing through as we should. Traffic. Um, I have not worked in a long time, which I've been so blessed to be able to not do work. Uh, I am, I do want to work now that I'm not pregnant anymore and you know, I just miss it because I'm a hardworking person anyway. I'm trying to find a good angle. It's kind of weird. I need to get, I need to get a, um, a dashboard thing that can hold you guys. Um, but anyway, so I have not been working and um, we've been house searching and then we had decided to move into an apartment until we can um, close on the house temporarily. Um, and it's been a lot because I really hate where we live in. I hate it so much for so many reasons and it's really been bothering me to a point where it's like depressing because I'm complaining every day about something that I can't instantly change. And it's easy when, you, when it's just you, but it's me and my kids and my husband and it's not just me. So, um, I have so many other people to think about and all this like that so I can't just jump here and there like I can just go leave an apartment and go to a one bedroom or you know it's different when you gotta think about everybody in all different parts but um the apartment we wanted fell through because of some shady stuff it'd be a lot of shady stuff going on right here and I just don't like it um so we decided to make a big move so we are moving to, I'm not gonna say we're moving to yet until, well you guys will see it on my, in the next clips, <laughs> I guess, cause I'm gonna be taking you along with me. So we are thinking about moving to Dallas, Texas. And um, it's exciting and it's kinda scary. And it's kinda like really an official, we gonna move thing by quit his job. And I feel like there was a great, like boulder off his shoulder because like his job was really stressing him out. He was really tired of what he was doing. And I'm so glad that he quit. Um, because people will take advantage of you as long as they can. And it's so crazy because the, the man he was working for also is the man that we had got this house from. And he, people, well, make, make it seem like they care about you so much and they don't. They just play their part. They um, play happy in your face until, you know, it's time to play you in your face if you catch my drip. Um, but, turn my signal off. But, um, yeah, so we are moving completely, and I am sad about it. I'm happy. I'm so happy. I've been wanting to move for like years now, you guys. Literally years. I've been wanting to pack up and leave. Um, I never thought I'd be going to Dallas, Texas, but I always wanted to pack up and leave, and I'm so ready to go to a big city. I feel like I've outgrown Starkville, um, and maybe that'll help me, you know, with my um, what is this? With my content. <laughs> um, it maybe it'll help me get to the places I want to reach. To the places I want to go and the heights that I want to reach. I may It may help me. You know, I feel like it's going to help me become a better YouTuber and things. Content creator. Um, but yeah, I'm sad because I love, I love it here. I've gotten comfortable here. I started my home here, my family here, my kids were born here. All of my kids were born here. 
you know, everything that I've learned and grown through through my adult life has been here. Like everything is here. Uh, I can see my mama every week, sometimes twice a week. And when I move to Dallas, I won't be to her twice a week because she'll be six hours away from me. And that's gonna be sad for me because I love my mama. She's like my best friend. I mean, I can still talk to her every day, but it's different when I can see her. Hold on. Okay, I'm back. Um, I forgot what I was saying. Um, yeah, like I said, all everything is just starting. Kaylee is in the car now, and she's. I Calm down. <laughs> and we were just talking about, um, you know, leaving and how sad it's going to be to leave because it is going to be sad. And uh, I'm going to cry. I'm going to cry. You guys may not see me cry. <laughs> so I'm going to cry. Um, because I am. Uh, I plan on getting rid of a lot of stuff this week. Um, I'm try to get rid of some stuff today before we leave to go to Dallas tomorrow. I'm um, gonna pack tomorrow and um, I'm gonna get a real lot of stuff. Throw away a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff will not make it with me. Um, Jay Majette had posted a video that she found from TikTok somewhere and the lady was saying that, you know, sometimes we have to cleanse our house, cleanse our items, not just save it, but get rid of things that were part of our past, things that remind us of somebody else. You know, stuff like that, stuff that we hold on to that's also holding it bad energy or those bad memories or whatever else so i'm going to get rid of a lot of stuff because i have a lot of stuff that has been with me for years and years and years and years and years and it's a fresh start it's a new start new beginnings and when i say i have things that have been with me forever like the animal board that i showed y'all in my last vlog i've had this since freshman year i have a lot of stuff that i've had for six seven years <laughs> and it's crazy but I'm a, I have like slight attachment issues. So I have a bookshelf that I've had. I have so much stuff. So it's time for me to let stuff go. Curtains, let stuff go. I'm just gonna let stuff go. I want to have a garage sale, but I don't think we'll have time to have a garage sale. So I think I might just take it out to Savage Army and just play, pray that God blesses us with more stuff. Um, I'm in the middle of trying to find me in a remote job while I'm working from home because Texas is bigger and the bills are bigger as well. So as though we're making it here with the rent we had here and me not having a job, it's going to be a little bit more difficult making it there without a job. I can't let everything be all on him. So we're just praying. I hope you guys pray for me, pray for our success. Um, and like I told him, it's nothing but taking a leap of faith. You know, my faith has always been big. And if we don't make it, we can always come back to start view. You know, it's not, we won't let it be where our kids are not okay. So we have, we, we're going to make it. We're, we are going to make it because we have kids who need us, who need consistency and like I was just doing okay like yeah we're leaving in the middle of the semester like she's leaving this is her maybe her last semester in start and she's starting a new semester in a whole new city a whole new state a bigger place everything new all new so it's gonna be a journey it's gonna be a little challenge but I think it's definitely going to be worth it Miss Alice said I might have a blast, but I want to still be in my classroom. I don't want to go to another class. I know, but I think you're going to love it. I think it's going to be scary, and then we're going to get there, and we're going to love everything about it. But um, I'll continue this later, and... Show them your new new with your little chubby cheeks. 
Because so it's It is 5 is 10. It is 5 10. Ah, uh, okay. It is 551. It's not 551, it's 501. It's 501. When we get to Dallas, it's going to be 9 o'clock. That's like 9 o'clock. Do it the heat again, we don't throw it the window. <laughs> Red it's not that I don't want you here. Yeah. It's not the way you said. I know that I don't make it clear. I call for you every time I try to resist. You get away. I'm treating these people and everything. All I want to do is end up just on repeat. I just been getting like moments. So hope you enjoy watching all those little clips of us eating food. <laughs> Apartment hunting. You can guess. Okay, well I, I guess more apartments coming out of this, but if you can guess which apartment we are choosing in the comments. I got some for you. I don't know what I got yet. <laughs> oh, I do know. So, guess which apartment that we are choosing, and I will do a, well, I'll give the winner, um, biome, probiotics, green, super greens, and super reds. Yeah, and they did partner with me to do a giveaway, so, gonna work. Also, you can enter, if you don't want to guess, or you don't guess here, you can enter on my Instagram to win, but you gotta follow me. You gotta follow Biome, and you have to tag two friends. <laughs> but I said you gotta follow him. <laughs> but for sure you have to follow me, you have to follow Biome, and you have to tag two friends in the comments. I'll make a post um, this upcoming week, very, very soon. Also, well, I don't know when this video goes up, so you might miss out on the, um, I'll go up next week. So if it's up in time, 310 Nutrition is having a Black Friday sale and I have my discount code on the screen um, and the link in the description box. So go shop with them. We're still in Dallas. We're heading to one more apartment complex before we head back home. They got so many options down here, like so many options. So far, I found 
a lot of um, daycares. I found my favorite. I have two top choices. And just went on the housing. Once I found housing, find housing, I can go ahead and commit to being here. Popeyes, and I am gonna try this meat, the stallion sauce. Let's see how it tastes. I got nuggets just for the like this little popcorn chicken because I've never. The black man, like, he was fed up. He was like, you know what? I'm gonna get out the chicken. <laughs> hey, she didn't have that money, get with He was like, this mother lied on her resume. <laughs> Hey, if she wanna get you after that money, I'm gonna drive off. I ain't lying to you. Well, I'll tell you, you drive off. You like these with the window. Nick, put that money down. She not give her some food for you the money that way. He probably gonna ear get the money. You didn't get the money. <laughs> Cause he was listening to everything. <laughs> Okay, it tastes like, um, what the sauce you put on shrimp? Tiger sauce. That's what it tastes like. I don't know, I could eat it, but it ain't no, I'd be crying to go to Popeye's to get It's sweet and hot. I guess. This whole vlog seem to be nothing but me showing y'all food and apartments. <laughs> Don't listen to Ode. <laughs> we ain't gonna get home till midnight. Cause I gotta feed the baby and everything. Hey, look, you gotta repeat it. You eat no damn. Hmm? Eat no damn. Give me your food in. You not hungry? You probably not eat it up. Don't be crying. Oh, there's some hair on this one. You see it? Damn, Papa had to don't do it. You don't see hair. Hold on, so y'all can see it. My camera can focus. Hold on. I don't know. Anyways. Oh, Lord. Shout out to Megan Mustafa. You know? Uh-uh. Yeah, she's she moving. I'm gonna feed her. No, don't. I'm trying to track it, so. Where's the D? <laughs> but. It's a tender nugget. It's supposed to be a nugget. What is this? I'm not going to eat it. Dogs, we got to get some dogs. No, ma'am. Hey, stand no big chicken. Especially when it's supposed to be small. Like, it's supposed to be an eight piece. What? Did you get a receipt? Nope. I doubt it. <laughs> She gonna go four fruit punch. I'm glad though, cause they save us some coins. Cause we got these and they more money. I want a kid meal. Oh, you want a kid meal? With one piece of tuna. <laughs> yes. 
Popeyes everywhere gets a hard time. Let us know. Do y'all have a hard time with y'all Popeyes? Cause um, the only, the best Popeyes is in Meridian. Not the first one. The one that's in like what's what the area? One of them. They got two. Only one of them five. I mean, food be fresh every time. They don't act this slow. Hey, to me. Hey, all you gotta do when I say it, hit the button. Repeat it. <laughs> or let yeah. you talk. Right. That'd be so. Is that it? If that was it, I would say that's it. That's the black four words. So I'm done my order. That's it. We're gonna say it at the end of the order. So just wait on it. If you ain't heard, that's it. That ain't it. And they tell you if you out, if you suck or not. They ain't gonna so give stuff and we're gonna I'm not stop it. Ain't gonna uh uh. They gonna tell you if they out or not. Hey y'all, start with I'm, um how about I stay yeah. out? Every time we pull up, we ain't got no. We got to be ghetto and loud. Can't leave. No, ma'am, it's my head hurt. You didn't even eat that chicken until you it's have broken one. Broken in three pieces. Eat it. Get that plate. <clears throat> I ain't trying to hear you. You been sitting here crying for me for my money. Get it. Get all that food. <laughs> eat all of it. I mean, every fry. Okay, broke the chicken till it twice and put it back in the she, this good, I, She's literally been crying. I'm hungry, my head hurts. She choking? Choking on what? You can't help fry? No. <laughs> Who did play that? Oh, I'm gonna eat the chicken, you get some fry. Let me buy a piece of chicken. Let me buy the fry. Yeah, dog. You know, see nobody bite and they mouth go to both sides of the leg. Give me the fries, you know what man. Happen. It's all gone now. It's yeah. gone. Give me the fries. The it's a whole big old side. Give me the fries. So you want to behind me? I'm just gonna let you have the leg. Give me the fries. No, eat the you chicken. You ate the whole piece. Bite the chicken. I want you to bite the chicken, y'all. Yeah, he ate brand new. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's good and fresh, you know. Yo, we I should got, got some chicken. chicken. <laughs> you got chicken coming and shit. Them was so free. If I had a new group on park and eat, I would got real quick, man. I'm saying I got a glass, I'm gonna eat it too. I don't like it, man. Maybe I'm gonna put them. Okay, okay, calm down. Tell you, we just want you to eat. Yeah, but you put on your head with her. He wants some fries. I just ate the rest of that chicken and I fell. He's like, he's scared to eat, like, like he don't be eating. It was gone, it wasn't that much to eat. Oh, let me buy it first. It was mine. I took it. I'm so sad he ate for some food after we just ate chicken like that. Yeah, I'm right doing. What? The rest of the meat on the chicken? No. Yeah. I'm getting him chicken. Want chicken leg out there? Yeah. Be good. Move, Kaylee. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. He gonna be on the road, bike. sleep. That's it. I'm telling you, we got that feet listen this time. We ain't stopping no more. Unless we gotta get some gas, wasn't it? We ain't gotta get no gas. I'm gonna make help wait, I'm gonna help wait till we get home. Gotta lay this motherfucker down. It's almost a four hour wait, but it's gonna be nighttime. You know, nighttime she go a long time without eating something for her one last time. Hey, what happened to the fries? You had a fries? I'm back up. Okay, let me go, y'all. Bye bye. Peace. <laughs>